I mean, what would you do in this situation, right? I would roll. Roll! Oh. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Modded Showcase Thingy Majiggy, where today we have two really cool mods to check out. Now, if you haven't seen the last video, uh, it was like a genetic... Uh, like an unhybrid <laughs> DLC, well not DLC, but uh, mod pack, which took Spinoraptor, um, I think it was Ankylodocus and Stegoceratops and turned them into legit dinosaurs. So if you don't, if you're not a fan of the hybrids, you have that option. Now, one thing I mentioned was that Spinoraptor uh, was something that was going to be hard to replace. Oh, look at all the fishies, they're so cute. They're going to die soon. Uh, <laughs> now, You've seen the thumbnail, you've seen the title. Um, now, my mods are starting to get really mixed up now because I have so many. <laughs> so, if we go in here, we have a Utah Raptor. It's not a Utah Raptor, no. This is actually the Spinoraptor, um, but it has been changed once again because you know me. So, what is it? I think this is really cool. We've had this dinosaur in a mod before, but here it is. Oh my god, it looks so cool! So this is a Concavenator. Created by Zach and uploaded by UNSC200. Uh, I think this is brilliant. Now, last time we showcased a Concavenator on the channel, it was a replacement for Metricanthosaurus. Um, and they, uh, like, I don't think that's too bad. I think, like, if you wanted to have, a, if you didn't like Metrocanthosaurus and you like Spinoraptor, that's an option. But this guy looks so cool. Look at that. I mean, it still has like the skin and the eye color that the uh, the Spinoraptor has, but the hands are different as well. They're turned in. I wonder if Concavenator had those kind of hands. I love it because if you're not a fan of Spinoraptor or hybrids, and you're a fan of Metrocanthosaurus or just general dinosaurs. Oh, it's so cool! Like, even the feet have been fixed so that there is no sickle claw anymore. Again, don't know how paleontologically accurate this is, skull shape and all of that jazz. But look at it, it looks so cool! And we've got all the different colors of the rainbow! Taste the rainbow! Let's see them all. So we got tundra, alpine, woodland, and I think there is one over here. And step. There's probably more, like with expert missions or something. Are these just regular skins? Oh, they are regular skins. You know what? Oh, let's have a look. I don't think I've ever got all of the... Oh, he's doing the thing. He's doing the thing. Who's a cutie? Oh, yes. Oh, that's so cool. I love it. I love this. This animation. Oh, look at his tiny little hands. <laughs> um, yum, yum. Oh, this game's beautiful. My God. Also, if you didn't know, I think I picked this up the other day. Ooh, we got two fishies! Ooh! Oh my god, I've already got the thumbnail in mind, but this could be such a good thumbnail! Damn, there you go! One million views! Oh, probably not. Definitely not. Not these days. Maybe uh, a couple of years ago on YouTube, possibly. Not now! My old tricks don't work anymore! <laughs> wow, I don't think I've ever got that, that uh, Spinoraptor skin before. Oh, that looks cool. Now, these guys aren't gonna get on. I think they can only have one or two. <gasps> oh, that's good as well. Oh, this is great. I don't know which one I prefer, though. Uh, it's either this one. Look at that. That's like a swampy one. I like it. Or it's this one. Let's have a look. I do like the base, though. Mm. Okay, it's either base or this greeny one here. I like this one. I like the magenta the purple, the deep purple. There's no animation for that fish! This game's awful! <laughs> so Frontier have also picked up the license of uh, Warhammer. So they're making a game, if you're a fan of the Warhammer franchise, uh, to do with Age of Sigmar, I think it is. So that's like the old, like medieval kind of uh, Warhammer. Oh, yum, yum, yum. oh, is that the same animation? Yep, that's the same animation. <laughs> Beautiful timing! Great! Okay, but that's not what we're here for. No, 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 no. We're here for something bigger. Are they, are they okay? Wait a minute. Oh, I must have turned them off fighting. Ooh, oh, well, I guess I'll have to turn that on when we release this new one. Oh, so sorry. I've had like three hours sleep. I tried to go to bed and then it got to five o'clock in the morning and I was like, oh, sod it. I'm just going to get up. <laughs> so I started, started working and then went to bed at eight. Oh, 
And fun fact, this was actually supposed to be yesterday's video, but the whole like competition to be uh, to be in the movie and I just thought I'd have to do that. So this is the main reason why I've come to this video. Here it is. Oh, yes. Oh, that's camouflage. I was wondering what, what why was it that color? <laughs> but that's camouflage. So this is Zilla. Zilla Indominus Rex. Oh, it's looking for Matthew Broderick. As long as he doesn't smell like fish, he'll be okay. So, interesting thing is, they've added the eye. I think it's just like a regular Indominus Rex eye, but uh, they just put some yellow in it. <laughs> and this was created by Cyborg Zeno. I think this isn't, this definitely isn't the first time I've said that name before, that's for sure. Uh, so let's have a look. Let's see what other colors we've got. We've got Alpine, Savannah, Rainforest, and Arrow. Now, there is an update for this mod, and it's added some new uh, skin colors for the spikes. So they're not all one similar color, I think. Although, I'm just wondering if I uh, if I downloaded it. I definitely did download that one. I better, better, better. I can't even talk. I'm not sleep deprived. <laughs> oh, yes. Lovely. You didn't tell me it was black. <laughs> oh, they do fight. Oh, oh my. Oh, wow. He's killed it already. Oh, okay. I didn't see that coming. Oh, the concavenators are conspiring. They're con conning. <laughs> what are we going to do, boys? There's these things that can kill us. Oh, I like that. Did you notice that? The, uh, the little sort of air sac. Or at least their nose, like, inflated there when it breathed out. Okay, so we've already got one dead. Uh, so how many different ones do we have? Oh, is that- is there only two? Oh, and his tail's glitching out. Oh, you know why he's killing them? They ate fish! Oh, no! <laughs> what are you doing? Are you having a fight with something? You don't have- you, I mean, you could have a fight with each other. There is definitely- Oh, God. Oh, God. Are you even attacking it? Oh, it can attack! Oh, beautiful! Oh, this is gorgeous. Yum, yum! Oh, that looks so sweet! Look at that! Oh, wow, I love it! Love the way these guys look. Now, obviously, they're working with what they can do. Like, that's the best that they can do. No! Concavenator! Oh! Didn't stand much of a chance against little Zilla. Rah! Guess you could call these te teenage zillas. I mean, how much health did he lose? Has he got much scratches on him? Uh, that could be the skin, though. That could be the skin. He's on 72%. Yeah, they're all dead. <laughs> they're all gonna die. <laughs> they're all doomed. Oh, oh, yeah, look. I don't know if that's really something to be happy about, though. But he has put multiple colors in the spikes. <laughs> oh, good job, anyway. So what they say, this mod will replace your Indominus Rex with Zilla slash Godzilla 1998. I have felt this mod has been needed. An Indom was the perfect creature for it. This is my first mod with full texture work. So it's not perfect, but I'm proud of it. Enjoy. And you know what? I'm proud of you too. You've got to start somewhere. <laughs> I will admit the model itself is great. I love it. I love the big meaty head that it's got. The spikes are really good. The only ones that are a little bit weird are the tail spikes here. And I'm assuming that's due to like a low poly count and there's only so much you can work with. Oh god, this is amazing. I love this. It's amazing how much uh, of a difference the yellow pupil actually adds to uh, Indominus. Oh, sorry, Zilla. Although I'm pretty sure that concave is dead. Oh no, it's still alive! Oh, and it's made this one bleed! Oh, that looks so good! That looks so sweet. Oh, now it's dead. Oh no, three bites. No, I like that one. That one's so cool! I've got to remember that skin if I ever get Spinal Raptor in another game. Oh, that one looks so good. Oh, oh, and there you go. There's a photobomb in one. <laughs> oh, wow! That looks awesome! Hold on, I'm gonna- that, we got thumbnail potential here, guys. It's such a shame! I know, like, you guys who don't have, uh, like, this game on PC, who can't have these mods. It sucks! I wish there was a way. I really wish there was a way for you guys to experience it. I guess you could watch the video, and if, hey, if there's something you want to see, I'll do my best to show it to you. I, I know it's not the best and ideal situation, but, hey, we'll make do with what we've got. Ooh, are you going to sleep now? 
Oh, look, little Zilla's tired. Oh, he's like me. Oh, I could go to sleep too. Oh, look at it. It's like praying its hands together. Like, I pray to Raptor Jesus. Give me a pony. It'd be so amazing if all I did is just put loads of different mod packs together just to see what happens to the game. <laughs> what kind of abominations we get. <laughs> like, have this Zilla Rex and then put, like, a different skin on it. I mean, we saw what happened to the, uh, the Spinosaurus that was a quadruped. Oh, yeah, we also have a new Spinosaurus as well that's been discovered. Good God. I wonder how many Spinosaur fanboys from the Jurassic Park 3 era when they're all kids agree with that one. Like, oh. <laughs> I think, personally, I think it looks awesome. So it does look like there was two skins. There was a dark skin like that, and there was a light skin like this one. But he's added, or they have added, I don't know if they're male or female, uh, have added uh, different color spikes for each of them. So they've got variants, which is quite nice. Uh, they've obviously missed a few spots. <laughs> and that's probably like one pixel. A little bit of more cleanup to do, but this is fantastic. And this is, the, again, the reason why Frontier definitely don't allow mods in the game. Because I'm pretty sure that Toho... Actually, did Toho own this? Was this Paramount? I don't know who made Zilla. I, I, I think Toho kind of gave them the green light. And then when they saw what they had made... Uh, they were like, oh no, oh no, we don't want anything to do with this. <laughs> maybe, maybe it, it technically does belong to the Godzilla license or the Toho own. But I'm really not too sure. I know that Toho can be very strict on their uh, copyright policy, a bit like Nintendo was before everyone started hating on Nintendo for it. <laughs> That's for sure. Before they started trying to get YouTube creators to sign contracts that, uh, basically made them give money to, to Nintendo in exchange for them uh, monetizing their games. Now they don't do that, which is good, but they, oh, pain in the arse at the time. Oh, it looks like its nose is a lot longer. Do I have any other herbivores? Then are they all the same? Basic, 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 basic. What's happening with the lifespan? Why is it 141? Is that because it's got like Dr. Wu DLC pack in it or something? Well, we've already got one making a beeline for it, bless it. Although it is hiding in a rock. Um, if you just stayed there, you'd probably survive. Oh god, they've all come towards it. Wait, where'd he go? Running, 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 running. Oh god, they're everywhere. Oh no, oh no. What, it's one of those. One of these is gonna get him. Okay, let's have- Let's watch this in cinematic view with even bigger black bars. That's how you know it's professional. Here we go. You ready, guys? Here we go. Zilla. Oh, goes camo. Oh, and wabush! Beautiful. Ah, oh, man, that looked so cool. Oh, and before we go, I completely forgot. We need to see what Zilla looks like eating a person. Did Godzilla ever eat somebody? I'm trying to think. Did Zilla ever eat anybody in that movie? Oh, God, did it? I mean, the fisherman. And then, I mean, technically, it, I think it ate a helicopter. But I don't know if it swallowed it. It definitely bit a, bit a helicopter. But I don't think Zilla ever ate anybody. It might have stepped on a few people and killed people by accident. But apart from that... Also, I like how these workers saw him like, Yeah, it's fine. We work... Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, we got somebody dying. We got somebody wanting to die over here. Come on, little Zillas. I can't use that theme tune anymore because it got copyright struck. <laughs> Oh, oh, come on. You want to line somebody up? There we go. Beautiful. We'll keep the big black bars for this one. Oh, no. You left her. How could you? How could you leave her? That is horrible. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Yum. There you go. Yum, yum. <laughs> this is what happens if uh, that nest wasn't destroyed. Then with a lot of little glizzlers. Oh god, you're... this guy's on a rampage! Let him go for another one. Oh dear. Yum! Poke it in its eye quickly! No, he didn't do it! Ah, oh, that's. If you're ever eaten by a little zilla, that's what you need to do. Poke it in the eyeball. <laughs> He's just got on a rampage. I don't know what the other ones are doing. Oh no, there we go. We got another one beneath. Yum yum. What happened to light indominuses? These are all like super dark, all of these. I mean, what would you do in this situation, right? I would roll. Roll! Oh! I mean, look how slow he's being. You could easily have outrun him. 
Why does everybody have to fall over and trip? Well, anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And uh, until next time, guys, you, you the guy who made this mod, Cyborg, Cyborg Rex, or Cyborg Xeno, you did a great job. As well as Zach, who created that concavenator, or UNSC that 200 that bought it. I really don't know how that worked, but it, I mean, the, the description just says, replace Spiner after with concavenator. So that's as much information as I'm gonna get. But if you enjoyed it, leave a like until next time. I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.